Hey guys, welcome back to another week of What's for Dinner. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. In my household, there's me, my husband, and our adorable one-year-old little boy. So for dinner tonight, we are having orzo pasta with spinach. I have made this a lot on our channel and I'll link a video uh, so you guys can check it out in the description box. And I had spinach in the free fridge that needed to be used up. And then I also had some shrimp in the freezer that I needed to use. Of course, you know that's Harrison. So the shrimp I just sauteed in garlic butter and then I added this seasoning to it and added it on top of the pasta. So this is what we're having for dinner tonight and we'll see y'all next time. Okay, so for dinner tonight, I pulled this pulled pork out of my freezer. I'd actually forgotten all about it. And I'm going to make pulled pork sliders. So I've got my pork here, and then I am going to use this barbecue sauce. I'm gonna mix it up and warm it up and put it on these um, Hawaiian rolls. And then I've got some provolone. Now normally I would use cheddar, but provolone is what I have open and I just have a few slices I wanna get rid of. And then we are just gonna have some Doritos. So a quick and easy dinner tonight. Okay, so here's dinner. Got our sliders with the toasted and buttered buns, um, the provolone cheese, and then we've got the Doritos right here. As you can see, they do not look like the Doritos on the package. They actually kind of look like just plain tortilla chips. Very mild in flavor, not spicy at all. Really can't taste any cheddar. They're the organic ones. I don't think I'd buy them again. I'll just stick with the regular old Doritos. So anyway, this is what we're having for dinner tonight and we'll see y'all next time. So for dinner tonight, we are having frozen pizza. It is from Motor City Pizza Company. I threw away the box to make room in my freezer. This was actually a two pack that I picked up from Costco. And we really like this frozen pizza a lot. This brand is really good. We like it more than the deep dish DiGiorno pizza. It just has a better flavor. The sauce is better. The crust is better. It is really good. I know you probably can't tell on camera, but it's a pretty decent size too. Um, and we got the ultimate meat pizza. And it has, what does it have in it? Pepperoni, Italian sausage, and bacon. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight, and we'll see y'all next time. Hey guys, today is Thanksgiving Day, and this is actually only the second time that I've made our Thanksgiving dinner. The first time was last year with COVID, and so of course I made it again this year because we are staying at home. So let me show you everything that I made. I made rice and peas for Howard. This was his special request. He is Jamaican and really enjoys this. And I actually did make this for our channel, so I'll link it in the description box if you wanna check out the recipe. And then I made mac macaroni and cheese. There's also a recipe for this on our channel. Um, that version is a crock pot version. This recipe is exactly the same except I baked it. I used white cheddar and then I just have the recipe. But again, I'll link that in the description box. I made some cornbread dressing and then I made sweet potato casserole, which is also on our channel, so I'll link it in the description box. And then neither one of us really wanted a turkey, so yesterday I went to Sam's and bought a rotisserie chicken, put it in the fridge, and as you can see, I didn't do a great job of um, cutting it up. We just wanted the legs and the thighs, and I also took out a couple of wings, so we're gonna heat that up on our plates individually. Yesterday, to cut down on prep, I made greens, collard greens. Now I normally make them with ham hocks, but I was trying to be a little bit healthier and decided to make them with smoked turkey wings instead. And I will say it's good, but I definitely prefer ham hocks better. And then for dessert, I made sweet potato pie. Also have a recipe for that on our channel too. So I'll link it in the description box. So once we get our plates fixed, I will show you our finished plates. Okay, so here's our Thanksgiving plates. This one is mine. I've got the sweet potato casserole, mac and cheese, chicken, greens, dressing, and gravy. And then this is Howard's plate. He has um, greens, mac and cheese, the rice and peas, and the chicken. 
So this is what we're having for dinner today. This is gonna be the last dinner of the week because we're gonna be having leftovers for several more days. So this is what we are having for dinner tonight and we will see you guys next time.